Morning. So it's a rare warm day in Loveland. In February. In February. It seems like every weekend, like, I don't know, in the last month or so. Well, it is winter, but. It is winter. It, the but problem is, is that it gets, storm systems come through on the weekend, and with the way the weather is here and the wind coming down off the mountains, it warms up just before a storm comes. So. It's always the same deal where on Wednesday or Thursday, maybe even Friday sometimes, it gets really nice and warm, like 60 degrees, just so the next day can be snowy and 20. And that always, oh, that snowy and 20 is always on a Saturday and, a and weekend, Sunday. And we can't go out and explore or have fun. So today it happens to be, what, 61? Yeah, a Sunday. So for Valentine's Day, we decided instead of going and doing a whole romantic date and, you know, chocolate, flowers, stuff like that, that we would actually buy ourselves some bikes. Chocolate is good though. <laughs> Chocolate is good though. We'd buy ourselves some bikes so that we could explore some of the many trails around uh, that connect Loveland and Colorado. So we're gonna take our bikes out today and just have some fun because tomorrow we're expecting how many inches of snow? Eight. Eight inches of snow. So we better get this in while we can because it's not gonna last. At least until spring or yeah well spring's only a few weeks spring's away spring's only a few weeks probably away probably not until april or may yeah you guys excited to go yes. bike riding yes yeah we're so excited <laughs> so we're gonna go check out um a lake that's about three minutes from us if you were yeah. if we were to drive well um, if you were to walk straight to it it's like three minutes but since we're driving to the a bicycle pass it's about five minutes okay so we're gonna um, ride our bikes around Boyd Lake and uh, just take in some fresh air I've been sick for like most of February so this is like one of the first yesterday and today is one of the first few days that I actually feel human you can actually tell them from my voice I'm talking differently but I feel human enough to go out and do stuff I've had these terrible coughing fits lately where I just have to like leave public places because it's so bad. So hopefully I won't be coughing up a storm here. Anyway, we're going to check it out and we're going to show you. You can go skiing, you can go tubing, you can canoe whatever it's a wide open lake you can paddle board and you can swim there's a swimming section here swimming shore and this to be nice and honest with you we could walk to it if we wanted to it's a little bit farther to walk if we wanted to walk to some of like the marina which we passed we'll take a picture of on the way back and the swimming area but outside of that we'll probably throw some still pictures in here it's pretty nice and if you look over here into the distance those houses across the lake that I just zoomed in on yeah they're not cheap by the way uh, they're not cheap at all so that for those of you who live in Flagstaff those houses on the lake run you about what a house in Flagstaff would cost So when we took our bike ride the other day around Boyd Lake, um, we bought two new bikes for Valentine's Day and then we bought all these accessories to go with it so that we could do like YouTube videos so we could, when we were on the trails, we could um, kind of use our GoPro and take pictures along the way or video. Um, so we, we kind of had just a whole bunch of mishaps um, when we got our bikes out of the truck and this bike rack here, you see it? This bike rack, this bike rack here that I, we purchased the bungee cord around it just snapped as soon as um, we tried to put our little lunchbox thing on it. So when we were riding, um, we couldn't bring any of our snacks with us, so we had to go back to the truck. And Jaden was getting a little hangry, and. Uh, it was just kind of like one mishap after another, but 
it was great to just explore the area and, um, you know, get out because, you know, the next day we had eight inches of snow and I'm just kind of tired of winter. I want to be out in nature. I want to get to know Loveland. So, 